Hello everyone who is watching me. I wanted to share something that God has sent me to share with you this afternoon. Before we share it, let's believe and pray. I praise the Father above in heaven. Let your will be done. Let your will be done. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. I want us to share something from the book of Job, verse 1. Job 1, verse 1. And I want us to look into, I think everybody knows, this man by the name Job. Job was a good man. When you try to look the characteristics in him, when you try to look who is Job, Job in Swahili they call him Hayub. Hayub underwent so many challenges in life. He underwent so many temptations in life. But at the end of the day, was a man of God, I can assure you. When you read Job 1 verse 1, it reads, There was a man who lived in a place or in a country called Huls. He was a good man. Can we find somebody who can tell people that this man indeed is a good man? We narrow down and see he was very respected. Like now, when you see the president of the Republic of Kenya live somewhere, indeed you can see he is highly respected. We now down and say, this man Job had refused to do the evil. In this generation, can we find any man who can refuse to do the evil? Whether known or unknown, we are all human beings. But how do we pray? How do we see? How do we, wow, people know you? Indeed, I want to see people when they see you or they see me. They say, indeed, this man has God in him. Indeed, this man knows God. I want us to be a lot more than say. We run down and see our second verse. First Peter. Verse 5 and 5, which says, Young people, I have something to say to you today. You should accept the authority of the elders. You should all have a humble attitude in dealing with each other. Like now, we have been faced to, to this pandemic, this pandemic of COVID-19 in our country. And this pandemic, I know if we put all God first in our lives, if we put God first in our country, I know that we are going to overcome this pandemic. I know God is there. I know God will be there. I know God will take care of us. I know God cannot let, let us die. I know we're going to overcome this in Jesus' name. If at all you trust in God, if at all you have hope in God, I know everybody is wondering what is speaking to me. It's not me who is speaking. It's God who has sent me to tell you that indeed he has gone to make us a praise. And that praise, we will dwell forever. We will live there forever. That praise he has himself gone to make for us he himself he has gone to make us a praise where we will live forever where we will be forever i don't know why you have not put your seat there poking your seat there is very easy just trust in him and do good things and repent your sins forgive your enemies love everybody as you love yourself they say in the bible my lastly i want to say this Job was a good man. Job was a good man. Why do I repeat that? Now that Job has faced so many challenges, in first Job 22, verse 21, it says, Now give yourself to God and make peace with him. Do all you get many good things. What is it that you do in order to get so many things? I know many of us, think that when you have everything you have good life no 
I want to assure you, there is in heaven, there is in heaven waiting for us all. If at all we trust and believe and repent our sins, so that good things can be done to us, and those things are not going to be done in this world, that good things is going to be done in heaven how do i how do i pray how do i rejoice how will i feel so happy to see everybody that i knew in this world even if i don't know knew you we are there sitting and rejoicing with god it will be my joy I don't want to say so many things, but all I say, just be ready. The world is coming to an end. The world is ending. And very soon, God who went us to make us a praise is coming back to pick us and get us our home where we live forever, where we will stay forever. How do I pray that you, you repent your sins, you get ready because God himself has promised us that he's coming back and we can see the world coming to an end. How do I pray that you have a very, a very present evening in Jesus' name, I pray. Let's believe and pray. God, we have said your name. Let it stick to everybody who will watch me. Let it stick to everybody who will heart this word everywhere in the world. How do I pray that your will be done to your people? How do I pray that your people are suffering because they don't know you? How do I pray that they know you and they do good things that indeed you have promised that you have, you have gone to make us a praise where we live forever, where we stay forever. Indeed, when you come back, how do we pray that we don't miss in that book of heaven? In Jesus' name I pray and I believe. Amen.